The NGO Coordination Board went ahead to make good on its threat to the Register Foundation associated with Nairobi Governor Dr. Evans Kidero. The argument here being the foundation had been given enough time to answer to queries on its financial sourcing and filing of returns and the red flags raised had not been addressed. But as soon as the decision was effected by way of this letter to the CBK, copied to the DCI, EACC and Asset Recovery Unit, Kidero's lawyers moved to court to change challenge the same. Appearing before Justice George Odunga, lawyer Willis Otino, on behalf of the Nairobi governor, sought and was granted a temporary order halting the deregistration of the foundation, pending hearing and determination of a motion challenging the decision of the NGO board. The foundation given a temporary lease of life before the matter comes up in court on March 13th for further directions. The NGO Coordination Board had in December last year suspended activities of the Evans Kidero Foundation until its directors submit audited accounts for the last of four years. After a 14-day window expired and a 30-day extension collapsed, the board, while investigating the compliance status of the foundation, said it had established that the organization had not only contravened the provisions of the Act and the regulations, but also the terms and conditions attached to their certificate of registration. That letter says in part, the foundation had failed to file returns and was operating unauthorized bank accounts. But in a quick rejoinder, the Nairobi governor told Citizen TV earlier this week that all information sought by KRA was provided and clear. The board's findings, quote, it's important to note that the foundation has transacted millions of Kenya shillings over the review period despite the fact that the foundation does not have any known donor on record, end quote. Kidero's counter argument to that. You recall sometimes in October, the NGO board had claimed that uh, there was 2.7 billion shillings in that account. All there was, and it was given to them, was uh, the balance, uh, what was in the account, was 44,306 mm -hmm. and 45 cents. And over the four years when the account operated, the amount of money that went through the, account, through the account was never more than 15 million shillings. Of interest to the board in its investigations as well was the composition of the foundation's directors, a majority of whom are senior officials of the Nairobi County government. Jackie Maribe, Citizen Live at 1.